Alright, here's where I was last time. God, I am so pissed off right now. I have been waiting the entire day to try and record stuff. I have to do four segments today, because I'm not going to have time tomorrow. And I was like 11, 12 minutes into the battle. It wasn't going well. And then I got fucking interrupted, and it just ruined everything. I'm s God damn it. I mean, at least now I have an excuse to redo the battle without having to record a failure, but... I mean, my god. It just... It's freaking 7 o'clock. Thursday is supposed to be my day off, and I... That obviously didn't happen. Anger! So yeah, just that was the only person I didn't fight. And now it, I've, like, spoiled myself for the battle, so I know what's going to be coming up. Doesn't mean I'm going to do well against it, though. I certainly didn't that time. But whatever. Get you out. Did I just heal? Yeah, I did. Um. I don't remember who I want to lead with. It, it, it's a big problem, and I'm just going to get that on the pause the thumbnail again, because YouTube has to purposely seek out the times when I'm showing the team instead of something that's actually noteworthy. Why can't it just let you choose your own thumbnail? I, I guess that would be too abusable or something. Just like people used to put the exact middle of the video is something unrelated, so that would take that, and then they changed it so it doesn't do that anymore. So whatever. Her first one is a, uh, Mr. Mime, which loves to use the baton pass, because it's a jerk like that. So I'm, I'm just gonna go for this. D I don't know how well that's gonna work out. Sleep is, once again, gonna be my saving grace here. She loves using Calm Mind. This Mr. Mime loves baton passing said Calm Mind. And it also loves setting up those things. So, yeah, I guess I'm just gonna have to go for a Silver Wind here, because it raised its special defense through the roof already. I was trying to conserve those, but... Fuck you. Seriously, just fuck you. She always has to switch crap out. Uh, this thing has Psychic on it. It's gonna use it, so yeah, I better go for this to resist it, put it to sleep, hope that I outspeed it. Thank you for missing Hypnosis. I love when that happens. Okay, this thing should die in one hit. It did last time, I think. Yeah, okay, good. Yeah, Mr. Mime's back. Uh, I won't have the defense anymore, and it's still asleep, so I should be able to finish it with Ice Beam. I could switch out something better, but I really don't care about experience distribution in this fight. I'm more concerned about actually winning. And this Gardevoir is a jerk. I'm gonna go for Bogey, because I don't really know why, I just will. Yawn, I guess. Oh yeah, and it has Wish. By the way, I did actually get some use out of Wish last time. I might not this time. Let's see. It'll attack me, and then it'll fall asleep, and then it'll heal from Wish. So I'm just going to use Recover to recover whatever it hits me with. Oh, thanks. <laughs> okay, fall asleep, damn it. I won't be able to take another Psychic like that, but I don't really care enough to heal. Because if I waste... Oh, cool. No! <laughs> Sorry, every little thing is bugging me now. Okay, wake up and don't kill me. Stop that! You're not supposed to use multiple healing items on the same Pokemon. She did that last time, but that was because she switched it out and then switched it back in, so it didn't really count. Yeah, yeah. Psychic, whatever. I 
think this thing has Thunderbolt on it, but... How much... How high is my speed? 86, uh... Whatever. 86 is, like, passable, but I don't know if it's good enough. Luna's slightly faster. I don't remember if it has Thunderbolt or not. I'll just hope that it doesn't. Oh. Okay. Come on, Surf, one-hit KO it. Strong stab move should work. And... What the hell? Yeah, it does have Thunderbolt. Nice to know. Okay, well, at least I finished it off. I'm surprised I took that hit. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't want to fight an Alakazam. Didn't even know she had that. I mean, I guess I should have expected it, but I didn't see it last time. Okay. I won't outspeed it. I might be able to take a Psychic. Hope the hell that this thing just doesn't mess. Okay, that was different. Now what? So one silver wind should finish this thing off. So I just gotta hope like hell that it doesn't wake up, basically. Come on, yes! Critical to boot. I hate this Espeon. I hate this Espeon. Oh my god, I hate this Espeon. It... It loves to put up a calm mind sweep, basically, and once it does, it's completely unstoppable. So I just have to go for the put to sleep and hope for the best method here. Luckily, Silver Wind is a physical attack, so the calm mind doesn't boost its defenses, but if this thing wakes up, it is going to kill me with Psychic. Come on. How much does that do? Not enough, but at least it didn't get in the red to use its berry. Okay. Thanks to luck and previous knowledge of what was going to happen, I managed to beat it. And now she's down to her last one with... Oh, God. No. No Jinx. <laughs> Only I can use Jinx. Nobody... Ugh, oh, damn it. I can't go for the attract route, because Molly's female. Um, Don't want to do a mirror match. I'll stay in, see if I can paralyze it or something. I, I can't put it to sleep, because this one has Oblivious. I remember that from uh, not last time, but the time before that that I tried this. So, Oh yeah, I can do that. Fuck. At least it'll drop its special attack. I might just lead it to do that on purpose. Uh, I could burn it. Which is which would be better, burning or paralyzing? Steady damage or slow down slash chance not to attack? I don't... Yeah, I'm going to go for the burn, actually. Because once it drops its special attack through the Psycho Boost, it won't be able to do that much. And I can just sort of stall it to death. Then she'll full restore it, but then I can stall it to death again. It's a lame, lame strategy, but it works. Yeah, and it has leftovers. It doesn't have, like, a special attack increasing berry, so I can't even use that stupid strategy, like, uh, Flannery's Torkoal. That Torkoal pissed me off, too. Okay, so now a good flamethrower to the face should knock this thing out. So let me revive Bogey, I guess. Taking my sweet time to let the burn damage it even more. However, then the leftovers is kind of canceling that out. The burn is doing slightly more than the leftovers is, though. Yeah, you keep on using Blizzard and missing, and it wouldn't do much damage even if it hit. It's always humorous when the opponent uses something that I have and I like, and then I get mad because it works. Okay, let's see if we can beat this thing. No! Like I said, them using strategies that work, that I use. Uh, um, it's just gonna do it again, so I might as well just 
keep doing this, hoping that it wakes up, because if I use the Poke Flute, it's going to put me to sleep again. Yeah, that'll happen, so... There we go. That was a really bad fight, but once again, like, thanks to me failing and then knowing what's coming, I managed to beat it. Not the greatest of victories there, but it was a victory nonetheless, and I'm taking it. I swore a lot in this segment, but man, I got really mad. So, that's it. Next time, uh, there's a bunch of stuff I could do. I could take on Cycling Road just for the hell of it. I could, uh, head straight to Seafoam or Cinnabar. Oh, uh, I think I'm just gonna look for stuff. Just take a break from all the battling. So yeah, see you next time for looking for crap.